case involves a 2018 Ford F-250 that was being driven by a woman in a parking lot in Corpus Christi. It is a truck that should have what's called a pedestrian detection system. It's a thing many people have on their car where it, it will see a pedestrian and beep and warn the driver of the car if they can't see the pedestrian, if they're in a blind spot, or if the driver is inadvertent. And this truck didn't have one. One of the things that made the case difficult is it was the first one of its kind that was going to go to trial. It was the first case in the country that was going to go to trial against an auto manufacturer for not putting a pedestrian detection system on a car. Number one, the difficulty in this kind of a case is you're having to distill an enormous amount of information, an enormous number of exhibits and photographs and documents and testimony of so many witnesses, and you have to distill it down to something that a jury not only can understand, but that's compelling for them. We needed an interactive timeline which constantly reminded the jury of where we are on this 60-year timeline. That was, that was really important. It was critical to the success of the case. I ran into Michael Schwartz at an Oklahoma trial lawyers event in San Diego and we started talking and it didn't take us long to get to what are we currently dealing with here that we're having trouble with that Prairie Nation Creative can help us with, can do its magic. And the timeline was a biggie. That was the thing I was struggling with. I mean, that's the kind of thing that I lie in bed and think about at night. Prairie Nation Creative exceeded our expectations. My God, I was hoping something could be done. I was hoping that it was possible. And it was pretty shocking the amount of information that very quickly got assimilated into this. Well, first of all, the design of the timeline happened rather quickly. I mean, it was, I agonized about it, you know, for three months. And Michael and Prairie Nation Creative put it together in about three weeks and it changes everything in the case, change everything. I mean, suddenly the, the big hole in the case is gone. The, how are you going to tell this story? Because it's too long a timeline. You can't write it on a flip chart. You can't put it on a whiteboard. And that really is what the case is about, is, I mean, in terms of the development of this thing, it's that timeline. If you're not able to show what you're trying to talk about, it's very, very, very difficult. The, the jury has to be able to see it and learn it and understand it on their own. Whether it be through a day in the life video or the interactive timeline in the Cole versus Ford case, there's a way of roping in professionals, really talented professionals, and creating something that is much better than anything you can come up with on your own. I mean, there's no way I could come up with a timeline in this case on my own. When you're stumped at something like that, then what you do is you go to Prairie Nation Creative and you say, hey, these people are good at what they do and this is wonderful. And then, oh my God, it's a relief. I would not hesitate to recommend Prairie Nation Creative to anyone who wants to maximize the value of their cases and the work product that they have as a lawyer. The tools that Prairie Nation Creative has at their disposal in terms of talent and the ability to create compelling product. There's a level of enthusiasm that Prairie Nation Creative is on your team and is ex as excited as you are. That's a lovely feeling, that's a wonderful thing.